All right, we're going to graph this function in uh, vertex form this time. Now you'll notice that a is 1. h, there's a minus h in the formula. So when we see x plus 2, that means h is negative 2. Minus in the formula, so we take the opposite of what we see here. And then k is positive 2. So what this tells us is that we have a vertex at negative 2, 2. Now, if you've been tracking from where we were um, graphing in standard form, we've already got step 2 done. We found the vertex, and, we'll, and we graphed it. Okay? So we got step two done. The axis symmetry is always a vertical line that goes through the vertex. So we can go ahead and graph that vertical line, x equals negative two. That's our axis symmetry. So we've done step one. Now we'll put in some x values to the right of the vertex, like negative one. Now we're going back to the original equation. Anywhere we see an x, put negative one. Negative 1 plus 2 is 1. 1 squared is 1. And 1 plus 2 is 3. So we have a point at negative 1, 3. Next, let's put in another value to the right of x uh, of negative 2. And so now we're at 0. So y equals 0 plus 2 squared plus 2. Order of operations tells us to do with some side parentheses first. 0 plus 2 is 2, and then 2 squared gives us 4. 4 plus 2 is 6. So we have a point at 0, 6. It happens to be the y-intercept place where our graph intersects the y-axis. Now we'll reflect those points. So we're done with step three. We're connecting. Uh, we're sorry, we found the two points to the right. Now we're reflecting those, finishing up step three. Point negative one, three will reflect to negative three, three. And then we'll connect those with a smooth curve. A is positive here, so it's a parabola opening up. I don't think your directions ask for domain and range, but we can find that real quick. Domain is the x values. You can put any x value into this equation and find a y value, so the domain is all real numbers. You can write out the phrase or write the symbol. And then the range, that's the y values. The y values go down to uh, negative 2, 2, so the y value is 2. For that vertex. Everything else is above 2, so dom domain all row numbers range y is greater than or equal to 2. If you'd like to check out any other videos, feel free. You can also subscribe to this channel. Later.